so when you are trying to eliminate the pure substance when you are trying to eliminate the pure substances you should be pretty sure that they are pure okay don't start eliminating the aqueous and it will be given to you okay so so if it is liquid then you can eliminate it if it is aq aqueous you cannot you can eliminate the liquid yes liquid you can eliminate liquid is pure liquid if it is h2o l it means it is l okay aqueous is impure aqueous is uh, solution no aqueous is solution okay so eliminate as in taking it eliminate it energy. yeah obviously you you can bring it here right because that does not contribute at any point of time it will not be be changing it right mm. it remains there there as a, as a constant so so it has no impact that's what elimination is kind of transferring it to the left side fine okay for example for example in a in a reaction of of ag2o plus the nitric acid giving you giving you agno3 ag no3 plus h2o okay here this is a solid this is an aqueous this is aqueous and this is liquid so again the same thing happens your kc becomes equal to the concentration of agno3 agno3 into concentration of h2o upon ag2o into hno3 not yet balanced oh no 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 is it balanced now yes so whole square divided by this correct now these two are the constants so so they go on this side and and i do not even bother to write them i straight away write kg kc dash is equal to is equal to ag you know Three, sorry, AgNO three concentration whole square divided by divided by HNO three whole square. Correct.